Yeah, what's up, y'all? Um, I'm making this video, you know, this for the homies right here, man. I'm just uh offering a little advice, you know, a little uh information on, you know, how to save money, how to stack your bread or whatever. And um, I just want to say, man, that to all the guys out there, right? If you just think about all the money you spend on fame. Now, I ain't talking about like people that's in relationships and you spending your money on your significant other. I'm talking about, you know, people that's in relationships and they, you know, got side jumps or people that's single and they dealing with multiple women or whatever. If you think about all the bread that you done spent on females, if you could just get that money back, like how much money would it be? If you just stopped spending your money on women and just started stacking that bread, like every time you feel as though you want to trick off, that money you're going to trick off with, put it in the bank in your savings account instead and see how much money you can stack, man. Because, you know, that's that's what it's about, man. That's And that's what type of time I'm on right now, man. And I'm not dealing with these... If you a female and you don't have nothing to offer, if you ain't bringing nothing to the table other than your body, then I, I can't deal with you, man. I'm not spending money with these women no more, man. It's only one female that, you know, one woman, you know, that I don't, I don't really mind spending the bread on because when I was fucked up, and even when we first started dealing with each other, you know, I wasn't working. I was getting unemployment. Then that shit ran out and I was going to school and she was getting me. And even to this day, you know, she looks out for me. You know, you know, even, uh, you know, I don't see her as much as I, you know, used to or want to. But when I come around, she cook for a nigga, make a nigga feel good, whatever, spark me up, all that shit. So I don't mind getting her nails done. I don't mind buying bottles. I don't mind putting gas in her car. I don't mind buying her shoes. I don't mind giving her money because she's doing shit to get the bread. And we don't even be fucking. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, man, that's just what it is. But any other female, like, nah, man, I don't got nothing for you, man. If all you got is your ass to offer, man, don't ask me for nothing, man. You get nothing. I'm about to just stack my bread, man. You know what I'm tired. It's like when you dealing with women like being single, you know what I'm saying? Because I want to be in a relationship. So I got to deal with multiple women to try to find the woman I want. You know what I'm saying? So when you dealing with multiple females, it's like it's like having a bunch of kids, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like it's like dealing with kids, man. It's like everybody It's like dealing with kids. They all needy as fuck. Oh, I need this. I need that. Oh, I need my hair done. Or, you know, I need my nails done. Or, yeah, my phone bill. Fuck. Or, you know, it's always something, man. Like, God damn, show. Work. Get a job, man. The fuck? Stop depending on niggas, man. Damn, you can't. You ain't bad, man, if you got to depend. If you don't got your own shit, you know what I'm saying? You got to depend on a man for, for, for financial sustenance. You know what I'm saying? You don't even know how you're going to get through the next day. You got to come on tag and show your ass for money or you got to call multiple different dudes. You know, fuck this nigga to get the phone bill paid for. Sure, you ain't no, you ain't bad, man. You got to do all that. You ain't bad, shorty. A bad female or as they say, a bad bitch. But, you know, I'm going to say a bad woman. You know what I'm saying? A queen, a goddess. Don't need a man for nothing. They going to have their own. You think Beyonce need Jay-Z? You know what I'm saying? You think Oprah need a man? You know what I'm saying? Bad women don't need a man. Michelle Obama don't need Barack. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's good. They, 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 you know what I'm saying? They feed off each other. And you know what I'm saying? That's awesome. But she don't need him, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all women, man, y'all just be out here like y'all kid. Y'all like kids, man. Like, damn, dealing with a female, like dealing with a kid, man. I don't got no kids, man. My daughter dead, man. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to be taking care of no grown-ass women, man. I can't do it, and I'm not. So right now, I'm in a process, like, I'm just stacked. Like, I ain't even no tricking type nigga. I mean, I done tricked off, you know what I'm saying? But I'm the type of dude that, 
you know, I got a good heart, a good spirit. So if we cool and I fuck with you, then I don't mind. Like, if you need something, I'm going to get it for you. But then when that shit become a habit and you constantly ask, like, I don't like motherfuckers asking me for shit. I'd rather do this shit because I want to do it. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't ask me for nothing, man. You know what I'm saying? But then that shit get crazy. You know what I'm saying? I got one female, you know, she my homie. We, 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 we cool. That's my, that's my dog. So, you know, I gave her a key to my junk just so not, you don't live here. You know, I gave you a key just in case you need to come through for something and I'm not around or, you know what I'm saying? If I'm sleeping, you want to come through, I don't got to get up. I did that, but, you know, my top lock and my bottom lock is the same key. So I didn't want a motherfucker to have access to, you know, that type of access. So I changed my top lock. So, you know what I'm saying? If I don't mind you coming in, I just had a bottom lock on. But if I'm not going to be in the area, nah, I'm locking my shit and you can't get in my shit. A motherfucker got mad about that. And I'm like, sure, how can you be mad? You don't pay no bills. We don't live together. You not my girl. You my homie, sure. How can you be mad about some shit like that? When, you know what I'm saying, you come over here, I feed you. Then you talk about you don't wash dishes. I don't even wash dishes at my house. You know what I'm saying? You take a shower, but you don't want to clean the tub out. Like, nah, shorty. Nah. I don't even want you over this motherfucker. You ain't adding nothing. You come, you spark a nigga up, but the weed you smoking, I done bought that shit. You never got no drink. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't never got shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, now nah, I can't take care of you, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving you access. I'm looking out for you like shit. Then you mad because you don't got the access to get in my junk because you don't got the top the top lock. Yeah, give me my shit. You don't need none of the locks. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Keep that shit the fuck moving. Can't deal with no... You a little girl. I'm on some grown... I'm on some grown man shit. That's just what it is. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, fellas, man. I'm telling you, if you want, if you want to stack some money, just just think about it. All the money that you spend on females, if you can get all that bread back and just put it in the bank in the savings, how much money would that shit be? So that's what I'm about to start doing. Like I said, man, because I'm single and I'm trying to find who I want to be with. You know, I got I got to deal with multiple females, and when you dealing with multiple females. Everybody got their hand out. Everybody acting like they don't got shit. Like, damn, do you got a job, bitch? Don't you work? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, why the fuck is you always needing some shit, but you got a job? I don't understand that shit. Like, females be thinking, like, a nigga got to pay them just to talk to them. Like, nah, so. You know what I'm saying? The, the man is the one that got everything to offer. I'm the one that got the bread. I'm the one that's making shit happen. I'm the one that got the spat. I'm the one that got, I'm the one that got the shit going on. You don't got shit to offer, but you're, I'm bringing shit to the table. A lot of shit. You ain't bringing nothing. All you doing is asking. And I don't need a female as a bill. I don't need you to be a bill. And I'm not taking care of no grown ass kids, man. Y'all females got to step that shit up, man. You know what I'm saying? I was raised by my mother, man. My mother, you know what I'm saying? She always was working and always struggling and, until she made it. And I watched that. So I know I know what to expect from a female. Like, my mother wasn't the type of woman that asked a man for shit or tried to get shit out of man or try to work a man. She always got her own shit. She always got it on her own and did it how she did it on her own. You know what I'm saying? She ain't need a man for nothing. You know what I'm saying? Not nothing. So, because that's what I seen growing up, that's what I expect from women. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that know how to clean the house, get money, wash clothes, know how to cook, and you know how to take care of bills. Fighting. You can do everything. So, you know what I'm saying? When, when I'm dealing with a female, I don't expect you to do everything. But you got to bring something to the table, man. You, you got to bring more than your ass. You know what I'm saying? Like... Yeah, I don't expect you to wash the dishes and do all the housework if you're working. But if you're not working, you got to do everything. How the fuck can you tell a nigga, I don't wash dishes. You don't even got a job, bitch, but you can eat food over here, but you can't clean. Man, get the fuck out of here, show. You anything. All you got is a fat ass and nothing else. That's it. 
You know what I'm saying? That shit is fucking crazy to me. You know what I'm saying? That shit crazy. Female, I had enough females. Like, yeah, man, come come chill with me and shit. I'm about to drink and shit. This bitch gonna say, cash at me. I say, what? Cash at you for what? Fuck is you talking about cash at you, bitch? I'm not cash at you for you to come chill. I can chill by myself or I can go around my way chill with my homies and shit. You know what I'm saying? I just want to be by something soft. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But if it's like that, bitch, fuck you. I'm not paying you to see you, bitch. Fuck you. Hey, that's fuck it is. Broke ass bitches, man. But anyway, man. Hey, to all the fellas, you know, I'm telling you. All y'all that, if, if you just think about it, man. All the money that you spend on females, you know, if you save that shit, a status, every time you think about, you start thinking with your dick and you like, oh shit, oh, this bitch going for 60. Yeah, let me get this 60. Man, put that shit in the bank. Every time you feel like that, put that money up and watch how fast you come up, man. Yeah, hey, man, stop motherfucking tricking off with these females, man, because now it's to the point that females really thinking that you have to pay them to talk to them. And the only ones that think like that is them broke ass female. They think that you're not bad, man. If all, yeah, you can look good, you can have a nice body, but you ain't bad, shorty, if you don't got shit to offer or if you out here fucking a hundred niggas to get bread. That's not bad. You can't be bad like that. You know what I'm saying? If you don't got shit, you living with other motherfuckers, you don't got nothing. Anything you get, you, get, you gotta get it from a nigga. You ain't bad. You can't be bad. You know what I'm saying? That's not bad. You just look good. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and you bring your value down like that. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man. I'm on my shit, man. I'm just stacking this bread, man. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm going to do for now, man. You know what I'm saying? I had to get my bands up. So now I got to stack. I got to leave these fucking females alone so I can stack my bread so I can get another. I can't. I got to drive for and shit. You know what I'm saying? So that's, that's I just want to uh, say that, man. And, uh, yeah, man. Like, st stop letting these, stop letting these women work, y'all, man. That's just what it is. All right, y'all. Somebody calling. And this ain't nobody I got a trick with. This a real homie, a real friend.